prochain orateur, Monsieur. Next speaker is from France for the PPP, Mr. Mariani. Thank you, madam. It's not the business of Europe, nor indeed would it be possible to behave as though a boundless ocean separated us from the rest of the world. On the contrary, it is in Europe's interest to develop a dynamic neighborhood policy with the countries outside Europe. To have neighbors invested with stable and democratic institutions is without doubt an excellent thing for us, and it gives us the systematic opportunity to ourselves be enriched by their visions of the future. In the light of this, may I salute those who created this new status of Partner for Democracy, which has already provided excellent results with our partners to the South, the Moroccan Parliament, and the, Na the Palestinian National Council. Today, following from the excellent work done by our colleague Chawushoglu, we are discussing the possibility of according this status to a country to the east, Kyrgyzstan. Opening up to the east in this way seems to me to be particularly appropriate, given Mr. Gross's report, which shows that this particular request was particularly well-founded. This country, where I've been several times, most recently as OSC, Parliamentary Assembly Re Special Representative for Central Asia, is, in fact, the only parliamentary democracy in Central Asia. Freedom of expression, freedom of association are for real there, in spite of the difficulties the country is living through. We should also stress that this request is supported by the whole of Kyrgyz society, which abolished capital punishment in 2007. It's our duty and it's in our interest to help this country to overcome the sizable and serious obstacles which remain to respond to the requirements and the values which are ours. And, of course, this is the point of this procedure. I fully support the concern expressed in the draft resolution about Kyrgyzstan acceding to the relevant conventions and agreements which are open to non-member states. And in fact, it's already a member of the Venice Commission. The authorities there have always shown courage in recognizing the obstacles they face and the ways in which their country is dysfunctional. And I think it's the sign of political maturity, somewhat rare in that region, in spite of the fact that there are positive developments here and there. Our decision will be all the more important for the fact that Kyrgyzstan, as a neighbor of Afghanistan, is concerned about its security as uh, the American forces are about to withdraw. Looking beyond the Partnership for Democracy, sharing our values with this country would be a very strong symbol in this region, which is always under the threat of extremists. And that is why, distinguished colleagues, on behalf of the EPP group, I would be in favor of granting this status to Kyrgyzstan.